what is a hearing test, and how to read an audiogram. One of the major hearing tests is called pure tone audiometry, PTA for short. PTA is used to measure hearing sensitivity over a range of frequencies, which is testing the softest sound people can hear across different range of pitches. We record the results on the pure tone audiogram. The horizontal axis indicates the frequencies of sounds presented. The higher the frequencies are, the sharper it sounds. For example, this is what 1,000 hertz pure tone sounds like, and this is what 8,000 hertz pure tone sounds like. Usually, people can hear sounds within 20 to 20,000 hertz. However, pure tone audiometry only tests frequencies between 250 to 8,000 hertz. Why? This is the range that is important for speech perception. The vertical part shows the loudness of presented sounds measured in decibel hearing level. The greater the number, the louder it is. Here is a graph that shows where some common sounds fall within the audiogram. Generally speaking, speech sounds fall between 20 dB to 60 dB. Vowels frequencies are lower, and they are generally louder, while consonants pitches are higher, and they are softer, which makes them harder to hear. For example, th, th, th. these are consonants, and they are a lot softer and higher than the n, R, E sounds, which are the vowels. So, what does an audiogram look like for people with normal hearing? The red circles indicate the right ear, the blue crosses indicate the left ear. These marked symbols show the softest level the person can hear at each of the frequencies on the horizontal line. As we can see, this person can hear really soft sounds with no problem across all the frequencies tested. The standard of normal hearing on an audiogram is slightly different depending on which country you are in. In Australia, we draw a line at 15 dB. Any results above it is within the normal range. Below this is considered to indicate some hearing impairments which means people with normal hearing should be able to hear sounds that are louder than 15 dB hearing level. The softest sounds people can hear is also called threshold. If the threshold falls between 20 to 40, we can call it a mild hearing loss. Between 45 to 65, it is a moderate hearing loss. 7 to 90, severe hearing loss. And more than 90, it is a profound hearing loss, which is pretty much deaf. What is the procedure like for taking a hearing test? Well, firstly, the audiologist will take a look into your ears to check if there is any wax or any abnormalities which may affect the text result. Secondly, they will give you a responder. Most of the time, it is just a button. You will be asked to press the button every time you hear a tone, even for the softest one. In order to hear the tones, audiologists will place a headphone or some insert earphones on or in your ears. The tones will be played into one ear first, followed by the other ear. The audiologist may also ask you to wear a bone conductor headband to check your underlying hearing. This bypasses the ear and directly tests the hearing organ. It is a fairly straightforward process for patients. But there is a lot going on underneath that I will gradually unravel in this series. Audiology is more than just hearing tests or hearing aids, so I'll try to include as much details as I can. Thanks for watching. Please give us a like or subscribe if it's useful.